Look who I am. I'm Elise, not Eve. Alice grew up in Austin, studied abroad for over ten years. You tell me she didn't finish primary school. Mrs. Saunders, look at the bottom part. Doctor of Medicine from Panago Tech Institute, key member of the International Medical Association, a rare medical genius. Are you sure she's Alice? That's how the leak puts it, but the details are unclear. Then, then what are you waiting for? Check it out. Oh, oh I'll check it right now. Alice, what else are you keeping? How is that possible? How could it be? It's at least just a country housewife. How could she turn out to be a medical doctor? Eve, calm down. How do you expect me to stay calm? I wanted to bring her into disrepute, and now I've inadvertently helped her. She's just a doctor. As long as you hold a place in Harry's heart, you are destined to be Mrs. Saunders in the future. <laughs> hold a place in his heart? I can no longer fake an illness now. What can I use to keep him tied to me? The, what to do now? I had just recovered. Then Elise decided to announce her identity. Looks like she did it intentionally. If so, I won't show her any more either. Who did this? It's her. I couldn't stand seeing them slander you, so I couldn't help but speak up. I hope you don't blame me. Oh God, I've been keeping this for three years, and you just build beans. It is. I can understand why you hide your identity as Rachel, but why did you hide your medical degree and education? If your father or husband been lying to you for three years, what would you do? Don't even say. Of course, I'd break his skin off and pull his tendons to teach him a lesson of deceiving me. I can't believe it. You've been married to Harry for three years and you still haven't told him your true identity? He probably thinks I'm a stay-at-home housewife who never even went to elementary school. Oh. No, Alice. What should we do now? Harry is definitely going to come looking for you. Pack your bags. We're leaving for Osnew tonight. Leaving for Osnew? You're not going to investigate the man three years ago? Of course I am. We'll just go to Osnew to lay low for a couple of days. I can't handle Harry when he's angry. Looking for anyone? Alice. Alice? I don't know Alice. You've got the wrong person. <laughs> Mr. Sanders, the address given seems to be wrong. Identity fraud. Address fraud. What else is true? Alice. I really underestimate you. Alice, we can leave now. Michael, it's so late. Anything that you call? Michael. Alice. Harry, why is it you? I called you so many times, but you didn't answer. The Michael calls you pick up instantly. You two really so lovely, don't you, huh? Harry, give me my phone back. This is between us. It has nothing to do with Michael. What are you trying to do? You are pretty protective of him. Send me your address. I'll go find you. I... I already took off my clothes. I'm going to bed. It's not convenient. Tomorrow... Tomorrow, okay? Alice, I hope you keep your words. Otherwise, you know the consequences. Harry, can you give me my phone back now? How well do you know Alice? You are her ex-husband. You were together for three years. You don't know as much as I do. We haven't had divorce yet, and you are already with her. Isn't that too soon to jump into things? <laughs> That's still better than you not being content with what you already have. Let's go. Alice, I can only help you this much. Alice, why did you sit down? Aren't you leaving? I'm not leaving. That bastard Harry couldn't find me, so he went to find Michael. What? 
What should we do now? Nothing we can do. We'll just have to face it head on. Hey, pretty. I really like you. Give me your number. Let's know each other. Uh, I have a boyfriend. We can just get to know each other. Maybe I'm better for you than he is. Is that so? Sorry to bother you. Wow, you are really something. You are so good at attracting attention. It's only you that being blind and others able to sing a true word. Let go of me! I can walk on my own! Harry, what's wrong with you? What's wrong with me? Are you not clear in your mind? You're a medical doctor. You're a member of medical association. You're a medical genius. Alice, how many more things are you hiding from? I thought you never cared about anything related to me. We married for three years, and you never even touched me. You seldom come home too. Now that we're getting a divorce, you start to care about me. Isn't it a little too late? The reason I seldom come home is because I'm afraid I couldn't hold it. Couldn't hold what? You don't even have to say it. You're just afraid that you'll think of Eve. No. Why would you think that way? Or else what? Would you still think of me when you stay out all night with Miss Gibbons? Alice Charlton, so I'm this type of person in your heart? Yes, you're right, you're this type of person. Loving people like you once is more than enough. From today onwards, I don't want to have any relation to you. You... What do you want, Harry Saunders? I... Mom! So now you're using mom to pressure me, huh? Let me tell you, it doesn't matter whoever comes. Uh, auntie... Elise... What did you call me? Bastard. Did you bully Elisa again? No, Mom. Elisa and I are doing well, right? Do you want Mom to worry about our business? <laughs> That's right. Harry's right. We're doing well. Why are you still standing here? Going now. Can you let go now? You have to act well if you want to prevent something. Go. Mom, why did you suddenly come here? I went to the lake today. I even caught a big black fish for you too by myself as your supplements. This is the soup I just brewed. Try it. Thanks, Mom. Something's wrong with it. Oh no, Mom drank the soup. Hurry, the soup. It's fresh. Could it be more stupid? Forget it. Thank God I brought my needle. I can help him cure. Elise, why aren't you drinking? Uh, Mom, recently I feel it on well. I can't drink fishy soup. This is very special. But Mom, no. Harry and I still have things to settle. We'll go upstairs first. Why are you in such a rush? Mom drank the soup. How could it be? How come? <laughs> Thought so. Why would she suddenly send the fish soup here? She was plotting this all along. Don't worry. The drug effect this time is much lighter than last time. A few needles will help. What the last time? Oh no, I've blurted it out. He wouldn't know that the person who helped him in the hotel was me, right? Faster. Help me. I'll do it now. Hold on. Hold on for a while. Where's my needle? It couldn't be. Calm down, Harry. Don't move. Look who I am. I'm Elise, not Eve. I can't. I haven't settled the issue with Eve. I can't ruin Alice.
He's actually holding it in for you. It is Charlton. Just forget him. The person he loves was never you. I didn't even drink the soup. Why is it hurting so much? Bring me to the hospital. It's been so long now. The effect should have started. Why is there nothing happening? I'm still waiting for grandchildren. Hey, it is. What are you? I'm going out to settle some business. Hey, then my. I have even used a great drug. Is that bastard Harry really having a problem? Alice, what happened to you? Why do you look so pale? I don't know. My stomach is in pain suddenly. Quick, go to the hospital. Okay. You're not even pregnant for two months. The fetus is still unstable. You have to rest well. What did you say? Pregnant? <laughs>